So, how did their love story begin? It was the spring of 2011 at Augustana College in Rock Island. It's freshman year. The first time she remembers seeing him is when she's having lunch with Michelle, a bridesmaid. He walks up to Michelle, who is his friend, to introduce his girlfriend. His first impression of Katrina, she's very cute. He had noticed her around campus. Her first impression, she doesn't have one. <laughs> Later, she asked Michelle, who is that guy? And it's the first time she hears his name. Sophomore year, they're going to a Lady Antebellum concert. Eric and his roommate, Nick, get two tickets. Katrina and her roommate, Michelle, also get two tickets. The four of them hang out before the concert in the dorm. She has a crush on him right away. They sit separately at the concert since they had bought the ticket separately. Weeks later, after Easter break, she's walking on campus. He waves at her excitedly from his cool car. His family minivan. That's actually when she knows she really likes him because he looks cute in a minivan. <laughs> he pulls over and says, hey, summer break, they don't see each other. But he does tweet her about Lady A, the country band they had seen. In the fall, back in college, they reconnect as friends. They're both in season for their sports, so they're distracted. Though well, they do see each other at the athletic center. December. They both have their wisdom teeth taken out. He has his done first. She comes up to Elmhurst to bring him ice cream and a DVD of the movie Up. It's a couple of hour drive up from Bloomington. She drives back home that evening. That's the beginning of him liking her quite a bit. His mom notices it too. A few days later, she gets her wisdom teeth out. He sees her. He takes her out to lunch. The next day, she leaves the country to study abroad in Australia. 9 p.m. her time is 6 a.m. his time. It's the only window of time that works, so they FaceTime or text each other. She gets back after two months. A week later, they have their first formal date at Thunder Bay Grill in Davenport, Iowa. They're both nervous. They have their first kiss. Well, actually, that happened before Australia. They've been dating ever since. Together, they enjoy cooking, time with friends in the city, going to movies, sporting events, and concerts, mainly country, going skiing or for walks, binge-watching TV, and their fur child, Buck. How did Eric propose to Katrina? They had not looked at rings together, though he does ask her sister, Cassie, the matron of honor, Kaylee, Hannah, and Aaron, bridesmaids, what she would like. They know her Pinterest board. He was not on Pinterest. So last Saturday, last year rather, it was a Saturday in May, May 7th, he gets her a massage at Massage Envy near where she lives in Chicago. At the end of her massage, the massage therapist hands her an envelope. She is suspicious. She's told to go to a certain address. It's a nail salon. He had paid for her to get a manicure. He even prepaid the tip. She had told him that if he's going to propose, be sure her nails are done. So he does. She gets an envelope from the nail lady. It tells her to go home and look in her closet. And there is money for a donut. It's her favorite dessert. So she goes to glazed and infused. In her closet, there's a choice. She used to pick her favorite black, little black dress. Two are the same size, but different styles. Dinner had previously been planned for the Metropolitan Club, the 62nd floor of the Sears Tower. They Uber over together. They have to go through security. He has the ring in his pocket, and he sets off the alarm. It was his only miscue of the day. He gets wanted, and then the security guard puts his hand in his pocket, feels the ring box, and says, I'm sorry. She's right there for all of it. 
but she knew what was coming anyway. It just merely confirmed her suspicions. They have dinner sitting by the windows with great views of the city. She eats. He doesn't, which is most unusual. He's so nervous. He goes to the restroom. He comes back and now sits next to her. He says a few words, but she does not remember them. She's in shock, for she knows this is the moment. He gets down on one knee. She looks at the ring, for the open box lights up. Katrina, will you marry me? She says yes right away. He puts the ring on her finger. They hug and kiss. The waiters bring champagne. His family knew. Her parents knew, for he had asked for their blessing. They meet friends for congratulatory drinks. And that's what brings us to today. <laughs>